All right, we're going to do Havana Shira by Josh Nelson. Not Joshua Nelson, who's another famous Jewish musician who does a lot of gospel Jewish music, but Josh Nelson, who does a lot of rocking out stuff. Um, and Havana Shira is, can be a rock out song or it could be a folk song. Um, the chords that Josh Nelson uses are um, E. And then he does a variation of an F sharp minor, which I'll just show you here quickly and then I'll break it down later. And then goes up to a G sharp minor. And then an A. And then a B. So, um, and it kind of goes like this with this strumming pattern, but down, down, up, up, down, up. And I'll explain those chords in a second, but it's like, uh, chords real quick. We've got an E chord, which I'll be familiar with. And you're just going to slide everything up one fret, and you're going to keep that index finger and where it is on the second fret. Then you're going to let go of these other fingers and put them on the fourth fret, also on your B and your D strings. But now you're using your ring finger and your pinky finger. This is the hardest transition to go from E up one, but then you're putting these fingers up on the fourth fret. If you can get that, then you just move everything up two frets. One, two. And then you're gonna go up two more frets with that index finger, and you're gonna go back to making your E shape, just like you were doing down here. But it's gonna be. And then you're gonna go up two more frets with the same shape. One, two. And those are the chords that, um, that we're gonna play. Um, I've got this little handy dandy chart here that I made. Try and get it close enough and in focus for you. Does that look legible? All right, more or less. All right, I'm getting cues from the director, so to speak, on <laughs> where to hold it. A little higher. Okay, so you can take a screenshot of that if you like. And um, there is an easier way to play this song if, if, if these chords are too hard. You can actually slap a capo on the fourth fret and play the exact same notes. I don't have a capo with me, but you could play, um, instead you could go C, D minor, E minor, F, and G. So with that strumming, that down, down, up, up, down, up, down, down, up, up, down, up, down, down, up, up, down, up. Let's try it. up for learning these other chords which I think are sound pretty cool let's try that one more time so E up with one fret on your index finger and the other two into the fourth move the whole thing up two more frets just go two with your index finger back to your E shape and two more frets on each of those so let's try that ha about the vocal parts and all of them they might be blended into each other a little bit and actually Josh Nelson I think he plays a little more of like a easier to do this down down up up down up down down up up down up it sounds 
very folky, very nice for sing-alongs. Um, so I think it's a great strum. Go ye forth and sing with the masses, Habanashira.